we're back, folks, with another gift request. Shout out to Montauk Ed for this gift. Ed, I'm wearing this in your honor and this shirt. Grandfather Mountain is in North Carolina. So there you go. I got the two things that represent your life in here. Partly represent you. I should have a big one with a fish on it or something. This is Johnny Cash's Christmas as I knew it. And Ed made a gift to the channel for me to do this one. So, Ed, shout out to you, my friend. Let's see what we've got here. I don't think I know this. Maybe I do. I've heard so many, so many songs since I got, I started the channel, of course, but so many songs that knowing which ones I've actually reacted to or ones just which people have requested and I haven't reacted to. So the title is kind of in my head. That stuff is just a blur at times. Well, let's find out if I know this one. I don't think I do. You gotta be sad. One day near Christmas, when I was just a child, Mama called us together. Mama tried to smile. She said, you know, the cotton crop hasn't been too good this year. There's just no spending money and, well, at least we're all here. I hope you won't expect a lot of Christmas presents. Just be thankful that there's plenty to eat. That's quite a blessing. It'll make things a little more pleasant. And us kids got to thinking how really blessed we were, at least, we were all healthy, and best of all, we had her. Roy cut down a pig apple tree, and we drug it home, Jack and me. Daddy killed a squirrel, and Louise made the bread. Reba decorated the tree with popcorn strings before we went to bed. Mama and Daddy sacrificed because this Christmas was lean, but after all, there was the babies Tom and Joanne. Babies need a few things. I whittled a whistle for my brother Jack, and though we fought now and then, when I gave Jack that whistle, he knew I thought the world of him. Mama made the girls' dresses out of flower sacks, and when she ironed them down, you couldn't tell that they hadn't come from town. A sharecropper family across the road didn't have it as good as us. They didn't even have a light. And it was way past dusk. And Mama said, why, but they don't even have coal oil or beans to boil, let alone apples, oranges, and such. Me and Jack took a jar of coal oil and some hickory nuts we'd found. We walked over to the sharecropper's porch and set them down. A poor old ragged lady eased open the door. She picked up the coal oil and hickory nuts and said, I sure do thank you, and quickly closed the door. We started back home, me and Jack, and about halfway we stopped and looked back. In the sharecropper's window, at last was a light. So for one of the neighbors, and for us, it was a good Christmas night. Christmas came and Christmas went. Christmas that year was heaven sent. Then Daddy put on his gum boots, waited for the thaw, back home in Dias, Arkansas. Pretty sure. Oh, I'm pretty sure that that's Johnny's real story, family story, because I know he's from Arkansas. Um, what do you even say about a song like that? I mean, I don't feel right rating it. So Ed, forgive me for not. It's his family story. I mean, I, I 
can't read something like that. I mean, I could, but it's just not in me. But yeah, I mean, you hear about these difficult stories and not have a much, and then someone else has less than you, so you feel bad if you're even going to complain at all. But then he pointed out the way they made it work in the simplest of ways. And this sounds like a memoir song of uh, a real thing. So yeah, and, and I like the way this song came in and it stayed with like this background, almost angelic harmony. It just kept the, the song with a very sensitive feel to it. And that was very, very well done. So, Ed, I really, um, songs like this are humbling. You know, they just sort of quiet me down. <laughs> um, and maybe that's what humility is. I can't even talk. But it's just gorgeous. It just is just, that's just it. So, thank you. Thank you for that, Ed. All right, guys. You can thank Montauk Ed for this one. Have a great day. I'll see you on another video. Maybe help someone out if you can, even if they're unexpecting it. There you go. Have a great day. I'll see you on another video. Keep rocking the country.